Hello everyone, welcome back to some more RimWorld Alpha 15. We've got a bunch of sappers, and they're right here. They're gonna try and dig through our defenses here, I think. So that'll be fun to deal with. We're gonna try and grab everyone. Jen, you're a deep no, never mind. Let's try and say like, hey, you're a decent shot, right? But no. Clover needs to be there. Matter of fact, we're gonna give Clover a poor sniper rifle with almost no chance to hit. It's almost better to give him the other awful weapons. Oh dear. Lisa, you need to be here as well. We're gonna try and defend our colony without Firefan, because Firefan is still mentally breaking. Angie, get to the front. Um. We just tamed a Thrumbo. It's like, wow, we instantly did it. 0.5% chance. How does this keep happening every time? I'll take it, don't get me wrong, I will take it. I will be happy with it, too. Jesus. That's a freebie. Oh, fire fan, thank goodness. You need to get inside quickly. That would be wonderful. Now as for our uh, dilemma here. These people... They're weird. Actually, I will go here and de... Actually, no, I will not deconstruct that. I want to keep that so they have to walk around it like any raiders and such. They're gonna try and dig there, which is totally fine with me. If we can get some of their frag grenades, we can use them uh, for benefit. They've got frostbite, that's annoying. I know you're vomiting, Firefan, but you really need to move. Come on. There we go, just move, buddy. Indoors, minus 18, ooh. You need to be in here, then. Just, you should be fine, you shouldn't lose any limbs to frostbite. As soon as that's over and done with, we'll be fine. Friendlies! A group of friendly outlanders from the Hacker's River. Ooh. Friends, they bring a they bring a pistol, a pistol, and a slave club. Honestly, while I appreciate the sentiment, I really don't think you'll do much good in the long run. Oh yikes! They are digging very close, actually. Are we being shot at yet? We are now. Come on, James. Get into a suitable position. I want you to stand over there. Uh, Lisa, go over there. Clover, stand right over there. Ooh, there's a bunny in the firing line. We'll have Josephine just standing here trying to distract all their fire. That's a normal rifle we can use now. Excellent. The Lynx is mad. He's going to attack them. Awesome. This worked out about as well as it should have, to be honest. I'm going to try and get away from that grenade. Thank you. Grenade is bad, go! Oh, thank god we're safe. Ooh, they're dropping a lot of stuff. I like it. Just gotta be careful that we don't die here. This is the weirdest fight I've had in a while, I must say. Oh, careful! Oh no, James! It's fine, it's fine, he just needs to retreat. For God's sake, there's... Uh, we need to fall back. This position cannot be held like this. We've got cargo pods near the thrombos, okay. It's simple meals, that's fine. 
They're still trying to dig. I think we've nearly beaten them back with the grenades. Oh, the grenades. Keep moving, Josephine! Come on. You'll be fine. I promise. They're retreating. Thank God. Bloody monsters. Oh my god. That could have been really bad for us. James, Josephine, retreat. Fire fan. Get some medical treatment. Oh my god. Well, we might as well dig this out now. Any of their casualties have anything good on them? Go juice and psychites. Yayo, go juice, frag grenades. Normal plastic knife. We'll haul the bodies, we'll haul the weapons. Guess all in all, we didn't do that badly. I mean, we've got some big injuries, but that's about it. I'll have you can see James mine his way to the colony that way. I've got a red fox here, I want to tame you. Uh, Clover, you can honestly just equip the charge rifle. It's way better. As in, the quality isn't that terrible, so... Might as well grab that, I guess. We managed to survive somehow, so that's good. Ken, you're a doctor, aren't you? Yeah, go tend to fire fan. Angie is starving. James? I ask you to mind that, please do it. This is gonna be very dangerous, but we'll put a million traps here, I guess. Or like, make a little defensive outcrop here. It should be within our, uh... Yeah, it is. Okay, good. I'll just try to dissuade them from ever going through there, I guess. Josephine is doing really badly. Unfortunately. James, please keep mining. Like, we might as well finish it now. Got more cargo pods coming in. And some granite blocks. I'll take it. Come on, James, you're nearly there. Finish machining, all right. Um, pumpkin, malaria block, wake up, brewing. We'll go for brewing. Or, although, I'd rather get like, dough juice or at least something useful. Electric smelting, sure. God, there's a lot of work happening outside. Yuki James, congratulations, you now interim construction guy. Until you get to safety, that is. And, thank god. Work, and you no longer need to do any construction, don't worry about it. Granite door. Boom. Lisa, decent medic. He needs treatment. Now. How's Josephine doing? Not even home yet. Oh my. That, that's gonna go, gonna go really badly. James has gotten treatment, thank god. Josephine is about to come back, that's good. Angie, I would like you to build a uh, granite door over there. Oh, you're gonna go all the way over there to get blocks, isn't it? It's fine, it needs to be done. Um, doctor, that's right. Uh, Simon, what are you doing? Oh, you're hauling a dead rat. That's cool, I guess. I'd rather have the bodies be hauled and such, but okay. Uh, we might have to put a temporary stock play, uh, stockpile down somewhere. I'll just put it in here. Like, well... Disallow food. And we'll disallow corpses. 
But really, that's about it. And we'll start stripping bodies if they have anything useful on them. Mm. Yep, Josephine has got an infection in her arm. I need our best doctor now. That'd be Jen. Treat right away. The infection will be treated last. Bleeding is stopping, but it's still not in a good place right now. Actually, you'll be fine. There we go, 54% treatment quality is not bad. I think James might be lucky and not get an infection. So that's good. Uh, wooden drug lab. Make medicine do forever. Not that we have anything for it. Angie is extremely likely to break, that's bad. But we've got a thrombo, life is good. You can see James is fully healed. We can now start heating up over here again. Triple defense here. That's gonna really help. And yeah, I know, people have suggested like, hey, you should link up these parts. What I might do is I might take out the wall here and then later on mine like a tunnel over here so we can access the weapons hall. Yeah, we'll go and do that. Then we'll, uh, as soon as nighttime happens, we'll reinstall this battery somewhere else. That way we will indeed be able to reach the sleeping quarters. And this little weapons area that I just put down willy-nilly. Because we can, I guess. Josephine, how are you doing? 25% immunity, which is nice. I'll remove the medical bed so you can either go and lie down in your own bed or just, I don't know, do whatever. We've got some research happening, which is nice. Anyone, uh... I've got Angie being able to craft, but Angie's always busy. Angie's a busy bee, what can I say? Oh, we might be able to expand this a little bit. No problems with that. Clover's like, yay, I'm gonna do this. Cargo pods, we, we keep getting a lot of cargo pods. There's some, 36, yay yo. Okay, I'll take it, I will happily take it. Hunter likes ranged weapon, alpha. That's right, you can now only hunt when you have a ranged weapon. In that case, alpha, just to get rid of the notification. Oh, medicine, you have seven medication left in storage. No traders are here at the moment. It's too bad. Right, now that we have a bunch of uh, things for corpses, we're gonna make a dumping stockpile over here that is specifically corpses. Just not animal or mechanoid corpses though. Uh, we'll delete you. This dumping stockpile is no longer allowed any corpses. We've got quite a bit of steel slag chunks here. And look at that thrombo one. I don't think we really need to train it in obedience, but we'll, we'll give it a go. You know, why the hell not? We've got a major break risk going on. Fantastic. You have any okay gear and you've got cloth park at 80%. We'll, we'll demolish that. These bodies need to be hauled at some point. And the loot. Alpha's gonna try and tame the red fox, that's fine. Red foxes are pretty neat. You can't tame it when it's sleeping. That's too bad, but I do get it. Put a second wooden door here as a sort of airlock thing. I don't know. To try and dissuade people from actually using this to attack us. It might work out really, really badly for us. Angie, how are you doing? Actually, Simon. Simon is doing the brave job of hauling bodies. What's your gear, Simon? Got a personal shield. Okay. I don't like that, but he is hauling the bodies, which is good. Pretty soon we'll grab some frag grenades and we'll start getting rid of the bodies. Excellent. 
We got a normal bed, a masterwork bed. Wow. Wow. Author Amelia N.G. Flay. This furniture is engraved with an image of German UKC James Graham stalking a warg from afar as the warg relaxes. The warg is looking around as though he senses that something is wrong. The image is bordered by four swallows, while the image somehow expresses both hardship and bliss. This portrayal relates to UKC James's successful hunt. Awesome! I will deconstruct you and I will deconstruct you. We are now becoming the elite. They've got an excellent bed. I think I'll give UKC James and Lisa the masterwork bed because it's masterwork. Oh, and a superior bed there. NG, la la la, that is looking really good. I approve. A lot of construction is happening. You could not make me any happier. Except I like hauling the rest of this stuff, like Flake and Yayo and things. We might have to sell that for science. Obviously. We'll expand this temporary stockpile a little bit more. Okay, you need one more over there, that's fine. There we go. It's still going to be temporary, but I don't know. We just need to store it space somewhere, to be honest. Okay, we are we are starting to get some bodies here. You do not have anything I'd like to have. You've got a poor shirt. I'd like that. I will strip you. Spirit took. Uh, we'll strip you. It might be worth a little bit of cash. And some human corpses over here. We'll detonate them first, I guess. Alpha successfully tamed a red fox. Seven percent chance. I named it Sunny Brook. Welcome, Sunny Brook. You're now part of this lovely colony. I hope you'll enjoy your stay. Angie, how are you doing? Just building things, smoothing things out, excellent. We need to get you bionic up at some point. Simon needs treatment for his gut worms. Get on it, Jen. He doesn't need medicine for that, are you kidding me? That's much better. Still butchering. We've got plenty of food left still, which is nice. We do have a connection up here now, so everything here will be uh, connected in case of emergency. And what the hell, we'll start like mining this out a little bit more. There we go, we'll get some equipment racks in there. Jen is wearing some horseshoes, that's fine. Severe illness on Josephine, how are you doing? 97% and we just got the notification. You will be okay, Josephine. Normal bed does help with building up immunity after all. Excellent. We're going to be mining this out, that's fine. We'll put some more racks down there, because we can. There are marble equipment racks. We could actually sell some of those. And keep like the normal quality ones. There we just get rid of that one tile. Anyone? It's, it's designated. Please? James? I know you like to mine. No? James has had enough of mining for today. Fine, I'll just manually tell you to do it then. Clover doing some construction as well. Actually, I'd rather have you smooth the floors. And she can finish off that rack, just to make it a bit more high quality. I'm pretty like that. Plus, I mean, we might be able to sell them for decent cash. That's normal. Not quite as good as Superior, but I guess we'll take it. Ah, uh, they don't have any beauty anyway. Right, we'll just designate a few more then. 
Excellent. It's gonna look really good. We'll have a ton of like rifle store there, like things we don't want to sell, just in case we want to equip people with them. Firefan is wandering around in sadness. He's in a moderate amount of pain. It's okay, Firefan. We'll, we'll make things okay at some point. We're gonna uninstall this bed. Sorry, James. You're gonna need to move over. Sorry, James. I'm afraid you need to get out of bed for a minute. Reinstall right there. It'll be fine, James. Just give me a minute. Clover's getting construction experience from building the things, but I'll let Angie finish them because I am genius like that. There we go. And good quality. Excellent. We, we need like 30 blocks for it, so it's a good reason to get some uh, marble chunks out, I guess. Go to bed, let Angie do it. Angie is now level 18, wow! Angie, you are literally the master of this. A local raccoon has gone mad. Designate him to be hunted and that should be it. We don't have a lot of components left, sadly. Aside from that, we are okay, for now. Simon! Just the person I need. I need you to drop your personal shield right now. We got a raid! The convicts have arrived nearby. Or are arriving nearby. Grenadier Douglas is a sister of Josephine. Any bionics? Anyone, step up, don't be shy. Nope. Normal knife. Normal charge rifle. No shooting skill though. You're a brawler. Awful rifle, but you have a passion for shooting. Pistol, survival rifle, shoddy. Not a great group, to be honest. Should be able to take them all, hands down. Connect up to power or what? Somehow I doubt it. That is too bad. We need him linked up so we can just fill up a lot of stuff here. And just designate things like hauling zones, etc. That would be wonderful. Anyway, let's uh go to check our batteries. We do have plenty of power for now, but it's still not looking too great. Get some sleep, guys. Tomorrow's gonna be a busy day. Yes, you can totally dig around my defenses that way. That's actually not a bad idea. It allows them to go through instead of around. Uh, I hate it when the AI does smart things. Simon, all that synth red shirt, I guess. Alpha's gonna play horseshoes. Oh god, Simon's gonna get attacked. It's fine. Uzi, James, and Lisa. Got it. Josephine, you'll be fine. I need Alpha. NG. Clover. Jenske. Jen doesn't need to be here for now. And we'll select everyone that's willing to follow and we'll just go. We'll set out and we'll kill them all. Sadly, that probably includes Grenadier Douglas. Um, I'm afraid you don't need to be with Alpha right now. Just form a firing line, honestly. We'll have our two shielded people stand out here. And Andrew's like, no, and dead. The firing line moves forward. We advance! Our enemy will be in peril. Gizmo! 
definitely don't start moving towards us. Dead. The firing line moves forward. It's actually working out really well, just moved them in fire teams of two. Uh, Simon, you have grenades, don't you? Start getting rid of bodies. Why are these people retreating? They're supposed to attack us, not we're. We're not supposed to attack them, but I will definitely go on the offensive as they, they just start playing cheap like this. Oh, oh that's fun. Macintosh, the computer. Just a random body. Yeah, these guys got mauled. I approve. <laughs> I just like some of these random names the game can come up with. I was about to say, what the hell's going on? But yeah, no. That was a plan all along. I hope Douglas lives, actually. Just because it's Josephine's sister. She's gonna be mad if she dies. Or, uh... Josephine's brother, rather. At least I got an injury. Also shivering. Go home. Ow. Tina lives, for now. I might actually capture Tina, so... Yay, that's good. Capture. We don't have a prisoner bed. Oh no! Prisoners! Still need to rework you though. Um, we'll get Clover to do that at some point. Alpha! Do capture Tina! We're not gonna fire on Douglas. No. We're gonna get Josephine to try and capture her sister. While we blast Mario into the next level of death. No, Josephine! Why did you have to hit so hard? Your brother died because of you. Not because of me, but because of you. Bad move. Well, there's not much I can do about it now. Got some yayo over here, EMP grenades. Sorry about that, Josephine, but uh, you were supposed to hit him softly. You know, knock him down rather than kill him. So I was like, am I done here yet? Yeah, fine, you'll move on to the next one. We did take a prisoner, I guess. We got some goju's there. I really think Sam's gonna get away. That is unfortunate. I wanted to try and kill them all. But sometimes that is how life goes. Uh, we may need a hospital bed here. Like a proper one at some point. It amuses me that I still haven't made a hospital somehow. Because we've been fine thus far. Yeah, give up the chase, guys. Clearly getting nowhere. We'll keep getting rid of some bodies, I guess. That generally improves the mood for everyone. Move over there, just start blowing up these bodies. Gotta be careful. You, nah. Go. You have anything? Not really. Good, 25, superior 40. We'll haul you out of the way and that's it. Got a normal park, huh? Trip him, I guess. 
Haul the parka, and that's about it. We'll blow up the rest. You really don't want to be walking in there, trust me. Simon has a tendency to be a bit inaccurate with that. That's enough, Simon. At least for now. Yeah, that is the story of how we got rid of a bunch of bodies. It's very interesting, of course. Oh well, not my problem. We need to heat this at some point. We need to draw a power line up there. And we'll put down a heater, why not? Put it like over there. I think, can we move heaters? Yes we can, okay, good. We can just plop it down and do whatever. <sighs> um, Built to train obedience, that's gonna take forever to train Alpha. The good news is, you'll be able to train forever. Yay! How's Tina doing? You're alive. Food poisoning from morgue meat. Chat and recruit. You're a cold loving psychopath. You could help us out. You've got a lot of decent traits. Luxuriantly comfortable in an excellent bed. You bum. Uh, we will reinstall this bed over here temporarily. We could use it as a medical bed for now. We've got an excellent bed here. Um, set owners. Yuki James. And Lisa, there you go. Tina's gotten sick from infection. Prioritize treating. They'll be fine. NG, I could use some stone cutting. Because we have like 170 blocks out of a lot. Our fan is eating. Good. No need to worry about the starvation thing then. Beautiful. Give me some more. You could just literally grab the chunks around you. And thank the gods for those workbenches. Those tool cabinets, rather. They speed things up immensely. We need warm clothing! For Clover. I mean, we got some clothing lying around, so... Just... Pick... Just pick your fancy, I guess. There we go. We'll get Angie to do some stone cutting, just to get rid of some of these chunks, for once. I will get you to do crafting a three, even though you're horrible at it. And so are you. It might lead to more people actually doing it, which would be appreciated. We're also going to need more animal beds at some point, because we've just gotten more animals. Like a thrumbo. He's quite young, this thrumbo, I must say. Is the other one still around? I think he left. Yeah, he left ages ago. That's fine, no need to kill him. Armor vest worn by Jen deteriorated away to nothing. Firefan is still a 13 in shooting. Lisa is 11. Clover is 11. Angie's 12. James is 11. Sweet. Like, our people are getting really good at shooting. That's good. I like it. I really feel like this, uh... Just getting, like... F one extra person at the start really helped, like cut down on the amount of time things take. I feel like we're in a way better position. Well, not necessarily better than last uh, last season. Or last alpha, but we're, we're definitely in a... We're definitely in a good position a lot faster now. Which is the complicated way of saying, we're doing well! Let's not die horribly. Finally, working through some chunks here. NG will need to go to sleep at some point. Ooh, it's the 13th of winter. It's about to become summer. That's good. 
Wow, comfortable temperature range, minus 126. You are showing off. Just need a bunch of these chunks gone, Angie. That'd be great. Have we actually gone out and hauled all the yayo that was out there? Or like the uh, flake or something, I don't know. It was 36 worth of drugs right there. I'm not saying we need the drugs, but we need the drugs. This is new, 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 new Amsterdam after all. NG, go to bed and eat things. Because everything is horrible right now. Yeah, go to bed. It's fine. You are cloud watching in the cold. It's fine. There we go. NG is horribly about to break. Very tired. Moderate amount of pain. Observe the running corpse. Let's do the quick gear check. You have stuff we want. You have stuff we want. You don't. You don't. You do. You don't. Okay. Trip those bodies and we'll explode them like a day or so later. Simon is like, ooh, I'm sleeping here. Clover. Ooh, electric smelting. Good. I want to see how Clover's cooking is doing. Seven. Unfortunately, you don't have a passion, otherwise you would be like eight already right now. We need a new stone cutting gen, eh? That's great. I'll actually leave the research for now then. Just so we can get some other things done. We're finally getting an electric smelter. Extracts usable metal from slag chunks and other mixed metal items. Consumes a lot of power. This allows us to smelt down weapons to their core component, for example, wooden clubs to wood. Somehow, sandstone club, sandstone. We could even get a, sil a bunch of silver from the silver club, so that's nice. And also plasteel from all these knives. That's why I've been nicking all the knives. Now as soon as we're hauling, done hauling all the apparel there, we'll blow up the bodies. And people will become a lot happier. It's about freaking time. Cargo pods! We get wake up! It is very far away, but we have wake up now. Life is good. When are some orbital traders going to arrive? We haven't seen one yet. Oh well. It'll be fine. We may need a better place to store all the drugs and just out in the open! Where all the animals and people can touch them. I think it's a good idea to have Jen do some stone cutting as well, even though she's horribly slow at it. It's going to help. NG, still very low on mood. I'm gonna wake you up so you can eat. Please don't break, NG. You could go berserk and try to kill people. That would be bad, for those of you who might not know that. That'd be really bad. Relaxing socially, getting some beauty in, and just joy. Good. Extremely comfortable. That's nice. Getting rid of some of the negative stuff. Good. We need to hold this body at some point. Why is nobody hauling that body? Oh, you weird animals. And you're gonna go back to smoothing the floor. Thank the Lord for Engie, you were doing uh, the bu uh, the building Lord's work, I guess. Clover is just doing a lot of cooking, which is fine. Like we need cooks. We still don't have a decent, like, dedicated cook. Although Lisa and Jen could eventually be a good cook. They're just not at the level right now. It's very unfortunate. Might have to dig like separate bedrooms in here. Not a bad idea, actually. That would lead to Tina escaping, though. So we need to cancel that for now. But we'll start placing like walls over here. 
So this will be like a new bedroom. Why? Because why the hell not? Severe illness on Tina. Jen. Treat Tina, please. You're quite far, but you should be fine. Get rid of all the corpses now that we can. Lovely. Oh yes, we should allow rotting. Duh. After that, please hold the body and let's get rid of it. Excellent. That's all those problems gone for a while. Until the next raid, that is. You did get treatment, right? Yeah, you're okay. Good. It would have been a shame to lose you to a random illness. Because everyone would be like, oh no, an innocent prisoner died. They were ill. That would be considered bad manners, I guess. No longer incapable of walking. That is good. Minor ri minor break risk. That's fine. We've got 600 blocks right now. That's good. It's starting to look like something. Slowly. We'll get you up there because why the hell not? Fire fan, please don't puke indoors. And she's like, I need to build! Quickly! I approve. Actually, uh, let's quickly measure this out again. That's a 5x5. Five five. We'll need to mine the things over here first. Yeah, that'll be fine. Just to make sure that nothing goes horribly wrong. And NG immediately goes back to smoothing floors. Oh, NG, we'd be lost without you. You work so fast. It is beautiful. We shouldn't be able to have any... Uh yeah, overhead mountain, but we shouldn't have any infestations in here, hopefully. Recruit failed, 0.67% chance. Oh my. We'll use this as a prisoner room for now. Yay! And then we'll put a wooden door in here. You're gonna be locked in forever. Hope you'll appreciate it. Someone take her to her room. She's still being dug out. Because that's how kind we are. We'll fix the heating later on. For now Simon can sleep in there. Because it's superior, yay. Psychic groan is ending, that's good. With that, we will end this episode here, because I've been going on for a long time. I like to keep these episodes a little bit longer. It gives me a bit of chance to... Gives me a bit of chance. It gives me a chance to get a bit more done per episode. And I just still really like playing the game. Anyway, if you enjoyed the episode, do let me know by leaving a like and perhaps a comment down in the comment section below. If you want to see more Rimworld, but you're not yet subscribed to the channel, then do consider hitting that subscribe button. And as always, until next time, have a good one, folks.